Sports Director and USC alum. Paul Sakala was at the Coliseum with a wrap-up of Saturday's game. Heading into Saturday here at the LA Coliseum, Arizona had only beaten USC four times here in Los Angeles, but One of the obvious conversation points in the post-game interview early Sunday morning dealt with Khalil Tate and how he brought Arizona back from a 28-6 deficit and helped the Cats tie things up at 35 apiece. Despite the loss, it was a positive to focus on for the Cats. Yeah, he's a competitor. I mean, he tries to make plays and, you know, it wasn't certainly, there's a lot of mistakes and on everybody's fault, coaches and players. But, you know, he's a, he's a competitive guy and I was proud of the way he competed. But you know, we certainly didn't play well, and you got to give them some credit for that. I was I wasn't as sharp on my reads. Uh, I was off on a lot of my throws, and I really just got to get back to the drawing board and practice on those things. Um, whenever I lose, I'm emotional. You know, it's, it's not any certain game. It's just I don't like losing. It's a real big learning experience. Toward the fourth quarter, never give up, never quit. I mean, uh, we tied the game up. We had we had our chance. We had the momentum. And then small mistakes. I let I let a route beat me. Small mistakes. Uh, they capitalize on my small mistakes. So just a learning experience. The torch here at the LA Coliseum remained burning into early Sunday morning as the Cats finally left their locker rooms, literally on what is considered Sunday, Tucson time. But we can tell you this: Arizona has a shot to rebound and pick up that seventh win of the season. Come next Saturday against Oregon State, back at home in Tucson. Thank you, Paul. Coming up next in sports highlights from the NFL.